Hi, I'm meteorologist Tony Petrocker with your beach and boating forecast for both Thursday and Friday. And, and once again, like so many days of late, we continue to maintain this kind of east and northeasterly wind direction. Uh, the, these numbers are mile, uh, sustained winds, miles per hour. They're not gusts. Uh, this starting off at 5 a.m. on Thursday with a northeast wind somewhere between about uh, 10 and 15 miles per hour. Here we are at about uh, 10 o'clock in the morning, generally 10 to 15, getting closer to 20 miles per hour just offshore, places like Block Island. Uh, Thursday afternoon at about 2 o'clock, east northeast, 10 to 15, but closer to 20 offshore in uh, Block Island. And then 4 o'clock in the afternoon, Thursday, east northeast, and still at about 10 to 15 and near 20 miles per hour offshore. That's uh, pretty much the same deal. Uh, Thursday evening at around 7 o'clock. Thursday's a sunny day. It's a dry day. We've got good visibility, no storms. Beaches on Thursday, all right. I mean, it's almost October. Why are we doing the beach forecast? Well, you know, this time of year, it's still nice along the beach. It may not be July, but it looks nice for a walk on the beach tomorrow, Thursday. Uh, moderate risk of rip currents, uh, sunshine and dry. Looking at air temperatures in the mid-60s. Bay forecast for Thursday, uh, a dry day. Sunshine, unlimited visibility. On that northeast wind, 5 to 10, but, but generally, you know, offshore near the islands, more like 15 to 20. Visibility is unlimited. And then we bring in a system on, on Friday that will bring in some rain or some showers. Right now, leaning towards the arrival time being more of, a, of an afternoon and evening. Uh, but showers and fog, uh, not a great beach day. Breezy, cloudy, and cooler on Friday. Bay forecast uh, with a northeast wind, 10 to 15, uh, waves of 1 to 3, visibility 1 to 2 miles and showers, though tending towards the better chance of showers being towards the afternoon and evening and into Friday night. At this point, we're seeing signs of some of that precipitation lingering into Saturday morning and then drying out Saturday afternoon. And, and right now, leaning towards Sunday being a very nice day with sunshine, dry conditions, and, and milder temperatures.